So we've been here in London today, uh, taking the next step in the rollout of the Shelley Testnet. And today it was all about networking, getting a small private network going, getting individual Jumanganda nodes talking to each other, communicating with each other, and really the first true implementation of the network phase. We have connected a couple of nodes following the Ouroboros Genesis Prowse protocol in a fully decentralized peer-to-peer -peer network. And, and this is major, this is very important because we have been running Cardano in a federated mode. This uh, milestone, this achievement that we managed today is a demonstration that we can soon be fully decentralized protocol. This morning uh, we went through the steps of downloading the Yormanganda uh, Rust node and, and running that node using a, a sort of a common a genesis block, so we're all connecting to the same network. We've always taken a step-by-step -step gradual approach to this and we felt that actually the most powerful way of taking that important milestone was just to get everybody together in, in one room. So looking back on, on, on this, maybe two years down the line, I think we'll be, we'll see it as early, heady days of, of ex experimentation. This is only a couple of nodes for a decentralized small networks but we get uh, first-hand feedbacks from users uh, on how to utilize and set up these nodes. Being able to use all these uh, technologies and, and software was tremendously empowering. We, we're building software, but it's not just about the software, it's also about the people, because it's about how people interact with the, with the system and, and how people sort of behave. Um, and people's behavior is very important in terms of how, how the network's going to grow uh, and, and develop. We took a very deliberate decision from the beginning of the testnet rollout to, to get the community involved right from the get-go. Being able to involve them so deeply in the project from the beginning has been massively valuable. Running a node on a RockPy um, is a very basic and simple example of, of running a node. It's not enterprise class hardware and an environment. It's very simple, it's cheap, but it allows everyone to participate to this technology and to this network. Now we will be able to start growing this little private network and we will be able to add more and more nodes, more and more users and start to grow and to demonstrate that things work and are ready for a public testnet and then the incentivized testnet. We can never really imagine what the future is going to look like but uh, you know, lo looking back we, we always sort of remember these kind of moments when it all uh, began and when it all sort of came together. We are going to monitor what's happening on this network. We are going to improve things, fix bugs. We will be able to understand a bit more the protocol. That's the first time the protocol is actually implemented. So today is a milestone, it's an important step, but we've still got a way to go on our journey. But we're very confident we've got very exciting times ahead and we're all looking forward to it. So after all this year of work, it is great to start seeing actually things happening uh, I remember the first logs of connecting two nodes locally on my machine, how exciting that was already. And uh, know that there are actual people who are going to run it and uh, bring that home with them and continue to connect and to speak to my nodes the, at my home. That's going to be even, even more exciting to see that. And that's, that's pretty cool actually. <laughs>